Stardo sends them away from the 1400 meter marker. Light of days at the back end early on. Vintage Crystal across the inside began well. Arabian Reds in the center. Hugs and high fives, three off the rail, looking for the lead. Blue Palace is also circling horses in the white colors, followed by Chronicles Narnia, the black cap along the inside fence. Then can't say no just outside of that. Further back in the field is Light of Day Races, one from last, and True Design is the trailer. There's eight, nine lengths that cover them. 900 meters left to go. Hugs and high fives after circling runners has found the lead. Blue Palace has raced up into second on the outside. Down the inside is Vintage Crystal, the black and white then came behind that one. Arabian Red got five lengths to make up. Chronicles of Narnia is further back in the field. Then can't say no. Light of days along the inside in the purple and yellow. And further back is True Design. 500 to go. Hugs and high five still in front here up the center. Blue Palace, Arabian Reds on the right hand side moving forward. Then can't say no. Further back is Vintage Crystal and Light of Day on the far sides also right in there as well. 250 to go. It's Light of Day clear by two. Vintage Crystal can't say no. Is up the center running strongly. Then came Blue Palace further back. Vintage Crystal comes at light of day. Can't say no. Finishing strongly on the outside and can't say no. Got there. Second Vintage Crystal. Then came light of day and further back in the field was Blue Palace. Here's Can't Say No in the middle, the purple and white. And here's where it starts to drift slightly inwards with Vintage Crystal and then Blue Palace further back in the field. Arabian Red tried to run on the outside and light of day is on the left. But it is Can't Say No that is victorious. 3-10-4-7 is how they cross the line. Can't Say No gets it right under Charles and Love, who records career win number three. And considering it's only her 11th start, definitely a cut above average. Very well done to her groom, Yandisa. He's going to be very happy with the win and with the fact that he's 1,500 Rand richer. And a big thanks to World Sports Betting for this super initiative. I've got Godfrey joining me to collect on Yandisa's behalf. Godfrey, thank you and well done. Charles standing by, he's going to grab the mic and come on in. And he's really gotten the best out of Can't Say No over the latter stages of the race for her to come through. And Charles, first of all, I've got to say, what a pleasure riding in Justine's colours. Yeah, uh, a big thanks uh, to Justine Lockett, the owner. Thank you um, for giving me another opportunity on this one. And uh, Charles, it looked like you had a bit of a rough passage here to find yourself a spot towards the final stages of the race, but you did exactly that. You know, uh, she's a small horse, uh, but she's got a, a, big a, 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 heart, yeah. a big heart. She's aggressive because <laughs> if I pulled her out, she yep. was not going to give me what she gave me today. And I just felt all the way from around the bend, sitting behind them, she was traveling so yeah. well. And I was sitting behind my stable companion. I thought, you know what, I'm in the right spot here. This race just went perfectly for, 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 for this filly. Can't say no. Yeah, thank you. And uh, Charles, I've got to say, a run that really caught my eye, two runs in fact, was her only run so far over course and distance was actually in the listed lady slipper. And uh, she ran fourth behind Splice the main brace. Uh, Charles, just hang on a second. I think we might have a bit of an issue with the mic there. Let me just check it out for you. It is, it is working, so I'm not quite sure what's going on. Um, definitely on. Yeah, that go. run, that run behind the slice the main brace, it was a good run. Yeah. The boss was happy, and I thought, you know what, this horse is still going to win more races. So. And you've also ridden against Arabian Red, and you were better off with the weights today, so it all came together. Yes, everything went uh, together for me in this race. You know, I needed the this winner. It's been a long time. You know, I appreciate yeah. the support from the boss and, you know, my fellow jockeys, you know, they always support you. E e even if they can't help you with giving yeah. you rights, just the comforting weights. You know, you come to work in the morning thinking it's coming. I knew it was coming very soon and today was a day. I appreciate it. Well, Charles, well ridden, good winner. Congratulations. Thank you very much to my two daughters at home. Thank you for the support, you know. Yeah. With my injury, the young one always say, Baba, come, let me massage you. Aww. You know, they look after me so nicely. I appreciate them, man. I'm, 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 I'm very glad to be their father. I'm, and I'm for sure them they to appreciate that as well. Thank Charles, you that's very lovely. much. Thank you well to done. the boss himself coming in now. Thank you very much, Baza. Uh, 
my, my colleagues at home, ma'am behind the desk, hello, stable team. You know, thank you very much, guys. Well done, Charles. With Inform, thank you for of the course. support. Thank you Fantastic. so much. Alan's made a mad dash up the stairs just in time to stand here and congratulate Justine on her fantastic win. <laughs> yeah, well done to Justine. Uh, a little bit of a surprise, I must say, but... Uh, we, we were, I was just chatting with Charles about this, and I'm not sure that it's so much of a surprise on that run behind Splice, the main brace, and the fact that she's bet off at the weights to Arabian Red. She had all the ammo. She just had to deliver, and Charles rode a great race. Yeah, I'm very glad for Charles. You know, he's had a tough start to the season, and... Uh, got his first winner under his belt now and hopefully the monkey off his back. So well done to everybody concerned, Richmond Highlands and yeah. uh, Charlie on uh, a nice ride. It certainly was. Alan, well done. Thank you. Can't say no in the winner's box. Huge congratulations to the Alan Cruyff Racing Team, Halo Stables, of course, to the owner, Justine Lockett. And I think, again, a great ride there by Charles.